you're a faculty at IU Southeast, you mm -hmm. teach music, right? I'm just curious, like, do you incorporate any of these experimental practices with multimedia and experimentation into what you teach? Most of what I teach are like private lessons. Like I have private students that play the cello. Um, I also actually work with school children, and uh, most of them know that I do a lot of weird things on the cello. Well, <laughs> they're mostly taken by me being a wookie cellist, but you know, that's that's understandable. Um, but they do know that I do these weird experimental things with projections, and so they ask questions. I don't push it on them. Uh, but occasionally I will introduce very, very modern or extended techniques and say, you know, this is, what you did was wrong for, what, for this piece, but in a different context, that would be really cool. <laughs> like, I understand, like, the need to get classically trained, right. um, mm -hmm. but I also think that in the age that we're moving into with hypermedia and mm -hmm. the integration of artistic forms mm -hmm. um, more into the way we communicate in culture, that that would really be a draw for mm -hmm. kids especially, but also for um, young adults that are college age, to right. wanting to be more involved. Right, yeah, and uh, most, most of the kids that know me know that I do this stuff, like I said, but they also know that they can ask me questions about anything. So very practical issues like, what, what type of do I get for my cello? <laughs> or uh, what amplifier do I need for my cello? Or things like that. So I haven't really integrated that so much because I'm, I'm part-time, you know, adjunct. Uh, I have no power there. <laughs> So uh, if if I you know were ever to be in a full time position, then yeah, I would I would definitely start integrating things like that. But I do actually occasionally get asked to do workshops, improv workshops, or extended cello technique workshops, whatever at universities. That was so, really cool. Yeah, it's really cool. Actually, we might be going uh, back to my alma mater. Uh, uh, I graduated from DePaul University in, uh, in November. Uh, they they have started this 21st century music program. They're, they're trying to integrate a lot of technology, uh, a lot of uh, new pedagogical techniques, and also bring in the entrepreneurial side of right. making a living as an artist. Um, and so they're, uh, they have like a lot of new music festivals, and so we'll be doing a 